Hello, Pilipinas. This is The Bench, and welcome to our huddle, where we offer layman's anything and everything basketball from regular dudes who eat, sleep, and breathe hoops. This is episode three, guys. This is game two of the finals, and right to my left, it's the birthday boy, Jay. Happy birthday, Jay. Happy birthday, Jay. Hey, man. Cheers to y'all. Looking at a mighty fine 35. <laughs> <laughs> And I think right above me, if 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 the screens are all good, is is hey Mike. Hey 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 guys! Again, birthday boy, repping the birthday boy right here. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, rep- yeah. I'm repping the home salsa. Loving it, loving it, boys. Yeah, yeah. just as a <laughs> as a background <laughs> lang, no. It's a, it's a background lang, no. If this is the bench, man, Spin Cafe is to be our dugout. Oh yeah, Spin Cafe. Right. Listening to right, the homies. <laughs> Yep. Check him out on Spotify, <laughs> the homies. Anyway, oh yeah, I just released the single today. Nga pala. Well, it's yeah. it's a remix of the latest single "Get With It" done by Rames Marsigan of well, well, you know, the he has. Yeah. Um, nice. He did a remix of "Get With It" that just released today. So check it out. All right, Oy. yeah, that's on Spotify. Will, and, will, that's will. on Spotify and YouTube, bro. Huh? Under JR Tech. Yeah. Uh, yeah. There's a music video though that's on Rames Marasigan's uh, own YouTube channel. Uh, he he created the music video himself. For the, for the so reading. guys, follow Jay ha huh, on YouTube and Spotify. Champion. <laughs> Thanks guys. Anyway, well, let's move to the game. So it's game two. Yeah. I'll start. I'll start you off, Mike. This time, what do you think about game two? Well, uh, wait, wait lang. Let me pull up my notes. <laughs> well. <laughs> Well, I, I think I think uh, no, I think I think the Suns showed how much superior their offense is compared to the Bucks, uh, and I think that's that's uh, a huge. I mean, it, it's mostly because of I think Chris Paul's I know uh, court generalship and how he he can you know dictate the pace of the game and how he can uh, orchestrate the offense. Because what I noticed. What I noticed early on was, I mean, in the midpoint when when the Bucks were were fighting back, Medjo, they had the uh, Chris Paul was able to. I mean, they they were just pacing the floor and just letting Chris Paul uh, orchestrate the offense. See? And it it's it's it's, parang there wasn't really any sets. Parang they were just freewheeling for the most part. Which, I mean, it's it's, it's a it's a big. I mean, it's it's a it it shows how how the Suns are just more superior of, in offensively than, than than the Bucks. What about you, Jay? I thought I thought the Bucks played a better uh, play the D on the PNR the pick and rolls better today. Mm-hmm. Um, Aton wasn't really scoring as heavily as he did on game one. Um, they sort of shut him down until Mezzo he kicked in around. Late third and the rest of the fourth. Um, Giannis really made pok pok today, man. I said more so than game one. Um, mm-hmm. We saw him really try, give it his all. He even shot over 60%, if I'm not mistaken, on, on his free throws. But Drew and Middleton were missing still, no? Yeah. So I don't know, man. Um, I think the zone D of, of the Suns giving them fits, but. Today, uh, compared to game one, they had more, I think they had better shot attempts. Eh? They just couldn't make the shots. Yeah. And I think I, think I can and add then, that to... And then to go... So yeah, go ahead, Jay. Yeah, to go to, to what the Suns did, uh, well, parang, parang Booker and CP3 are way superior with regards to getting their buckets. Man. Right. It's so much easier yep. for them to, to you know, they are legit scorers, unlike, uh, I mean, as compared to Drew and Middleton, at least today. Iba, mm-hmm. ibang, iba yung level, man. Superstar, second tier yung dalawa. And I think to a yeah. certain extent, even on Yanis, kasi si Yanis, I mean, there are times that Yanis str- uh, struggles to get his buckets, di ba? Well, me, I, well, hey, I, I'm... I'm with... Go ahead, I'm looking... Julio. No, no, I'm looking at this and I'm, I'm just going to say I'm with I, I'm with Jay. I mean, what else can you expect from Giannis? I'm looking at his stats right now. And this is 42, 42 points, 12 rebounds, one steal, three blocks. 
he shot 15 for 20. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, okay. And on, on that note, and then Mike Naman, you also mentioned um, Drew Holiday and Middleton. You have Giannis already showing up with 42. Even though Drew had 17 points, that's 7 for 21 shooting. And yeah, then Middleton, yeah, had, yeah. Middleton had 11, 5 for 16 shooting. Mm-hmm. Minus 15. Pa si, si Middleton, minus 15. Si Holiday, minus 3. Si Giannis, who you expect to be at around the same with them because their starters was a plus three. Yep. So, in other words, they were stinking it up while they were on the yeah. court with Conaton, actually. In fact, right, Conaton right, played right. well, but he was a minus 14. Right. That's that's right. weird also. So, technically, Giannis was actually doing his, his part, but that's it. Yeah. How, how, how do you... <laughs> They're hard, you know? It's hard to... It's hard to... to break that down. Eh. Uh, and do, eh. Everything yeah. he could do, he did today. Yep, yep. he... Wala, uh, talagang, I think the ro- roster to roster lamang na lamang the yeah. Suns man. I think um, um I think like you guys said it's superior superiorly of um, offensively superior. I think it's looking yeah. like yeah it's parang it's heading to that dare I say outclassed na sila kumbaga the, it's li- slow little by little you're seeing that Middleton cannot create right. shots the way Booker can. Right. Giroud right. we were joking maybe Giroud did lose a step already from his. New Orleans. But days. I mean, when it comes to, in terms of Drew, I think it's not for lack of trying and the, the aggression because eh? he, he tried yeah, to get his shots, well, but he just didn't make him. Yeah. He just didn't make him. So. Right. And none of the 17 points he scored were impactful. Enough. Right, right. Also. And then, okay. I you know, there was, a, there was a. Go ahead. No, okay. No, I was going to add that you guys mentioned like. Not impactful, um, Jeru and um, Middleton, and then all of a sudden, right. on the sun side, you have the, who the hell's Miles Bridges scoring right. twenty-seven points in a finals game. Mikael Bridges, dude, see Miles Bridges Mikhail, at the end. Hey, uh, Miles side. Bridges, Mikael Bridges, <laughs> Mikael Bridges, Mikael Bridges. Scored yeah, grab his contribution and. The Suns nga have actually lost two guys that is part of the rotation. Saric, and then they lost another guy today. But it seems like they have enough in the well, man, to keep fielding yeah. these guys that, that show up for them. Eh. And, and it's not just... There was this one... And for me, it's not lang quantity of the 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 Suns bench, but it's the quality also. Eh. You guys... You, you have, oh, like, quality anyway, talaga. You have guys like Bridges who scored... How how much how many points did he score today? Twenty seven. Twenty seven. But you had campaign Cameron Payne in the Western Finals who had that big game also. So yeah, they, I mean, yep. at any given time, you can have these mga big outbursts. any of them. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And then the consistent one lang. I mean, kumbaga, what what it seems like, huh? You have consistently lang Booker and Paul doing what they do. But yeah. Booker and Paul consistent. Whether it's Chris Paul right. top scorer, Devin Book top scorer. And then every like, like campaign only scored two points today. Cam Johnson right, eight right. points, but here comes Mikhail Bridges, diba? So, yeah. voila. So, and then you have the. I don't know. Oh, go go. Anyway, Yanis yeah. Yanis had Yanis broke a record today. He scored twenty points in one quarter, right. the third, no. Twenty points, beating out Kobe Bryant and LeBron. That other Malone guy. No LeBron. No ah LeBron ba? Yeah, LeBron, yeah, LeBron. Yeah, that other Beating out Kobe and LeBron <laughs> with 19 formerly. So now he has now he has uh, no, he has that record. He, did, he really did everything just to stress that point. And there was a period, nine minutes left in the third quarter, where the Bucks brought it down to five points. Right, right. And I yeah. thought, Uy, baka, di ba? we were chatting earlier. Baka this is baka this is it. Let's see if the Suns can stem the tide. Booker comes in, hits a freaking yeah, yeah, yeah. three again. Boom! <laughs> And then the next possession, another three. Boom. And that was, and that was oh, very, back up to ten, man. And that was, was very, three. very glaring also in the entire game. Na every time the Bucks would fight back, grab the composure of the Suns, dude. And they yeah, were, very, they were never rattled. Walang taranta, walang taranta, de ba? Yeah. And and they were, walang, walang no four shots, nothing, man. It's just like business as usual, dude. <laughs> I was surprised that after bringing it down to five points, na lang. With nine minutes left, they leave Booker that open for Yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, and okay, that I, was I'm pu- super wide down, straight down the I'm line. Pulling up three, some man. Booker stats. Booker is such a weird 
Oh, good. Ah. But Booker, for me, ha, Booker is such a weird type of scorer because you cannot box him as a three-point shooter or a two-point oh, guy. Right. Eh. Uh, Can you imagine? Yeah, today, he, does today, he went seven for 12 today from three points. Ha, today. The game before that, he was one for eight. The, pero 27 points. Right. The game before that, right. he was yeah. one for seven from three, pero 22 points. Yeah. And then yeah. before that, naman, four for six for 31 mm-hmm. points. So you don't really know where Booker's points are going to come from. I mean, he can oh, even do it right, from the two point right. area. He can do it from scoring. I think it boils. Yeah, I think it boils down to him just really a pocket getter, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, he's but um, you know, I, I I hate to say it because he's my favorite player, but uh, Kobe, you eh, know, <laughs> he can <laughs> score from anywhere, man. He drives, he drives, he takes that mid range elbow shot, boom. He banks a shot, pa. Then he'll hit the three. Yeah. He, he's a scorer, man. Yeah. Pure scorer. Oh, I mean, that 70 what? point game at Boston Gardens. Yeah, I was going to say that. You know, it's, uh, I, yeah. I don't want to bring up that yeah, game. That's but proof of that. There were no three pointers in that game. Very little, from what I remember. Yep. That was, yeah. that was yeah. not like a Hindi yun parang step yeah. in uh, 60 yeah. points and then he has 11 three pointers. Hindi right. ganon yun eh. Yep. No, you're right. You're right. From he what, can just what, get buckets, man. He can get buckets, talaga. And wait, so since you yeah. mentioned that's that. Not, Oh, go, go. That's not something that obviously the, the, the box really don't have, man. As much as Middleton's capable of scoring 42, but he has yeah. to he has to be in a in a different zone to be able to do that. Yeah. See, Booker can do it any game, man. Yeah. Since you mentioned that in Kobe, should we seg this into that list that you gave us, Mike? Since ah, well, there. Yeah. Actually, right there. Oh, siga, siga. Yeah. What pick? Well, let's just start us. Let's start off, Muna. What pick was Devin Booker? Uh, Devin but Booker he's... was 13th pick. And then you got a list. Yeah. Of... So I so I found an interesting list of the top 10 players. Um, top 10, 13, who were drafted 13th overall. In the... 13th, smart guy. So let's go down the list, no? Uh, and upwards. Ten, ten, from, down, 10 going going uh, to ten, one. Yeah. Ten going up, so, so number 10 is Dale Davis. Again, all of these players, all of these players drafted number 13. 13. We are yeah, just yeah. ranking them from 10 to 1, but they're yeah. all 13th picks. Well, this is the I'll 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 I'll, I'll from, uh, what side uh, from what side? From, from who, the side. Who's ranking? Uh fadeaway world. Uh, no, no, yeah. This is from fadeawayworld.net. Okay. So a 2018 so, article. So baka hindi pa kasama. Who was 13th pick pala 2019? No, no. So anyway, I, I heard I heard the list. Okay, and that's that's I So anyway, this is okay. this is the list yeah, yeah. and then let's just chime in along on our thoughts. Yeah. Number 10 is Dale Davis, Indiana Pacers. I like them. It's okay. Good. Number good 9, team. yeah, part of the Davis boys. Yep. Number 9 is Donovan Mitchell. Wild, no? Can you imagine that he also dropped that low? Yep. And we were talking, Kanina, in, in his first summer league game, they found him so short. They thought he was going to be a point guard shooting guard. On his first summer league game, the guy pops 40 in one of those <laughs> in the Vegas Classic yeah. Yata or something. Also, yeah, continue, continue. And then the guy's a star, man. Of course, number eight is Devin Booker. Number eight. Oh, he's eighth, pa nga. Yeah, number eight pa on the list. But oh, I, I don't always. agree. I don't agree. Yeah. On, well, it's yeah. early pa kasi in his yeah, career. Yeah, yeah. He, if, you're talking about, <laughs> if you're talking about Weird potential, this, this is not. The, yeah. He goes up that right. he goes he goes up that yeah. list yeah. this year already. Seguro. Easily okay, up that list. So yeah, number yeah. number seven is Sleepy Floyd. Okay. Hey, Dobbs. Hey, he was part of that uh, that yeah. playoff run, yeah. magical Dobbs playoff run. Yep. Scored what fifty or something crazy he like just... that against the Lakers, man. Oh, he, he scored played. the most yata yeah. in the second. Yeah, that was against the Lakers. Eh? Yeah, against yeah. the Lakers. And yeah. He played for the Spurs yeah. also. <laughs> So he was too yeah. sleepy yeah. then. <laughs> Just to keep the Spurs relevant. Oh, uh, who's that? <laughs> <laughs> number six, uh, Richard Jefferson. Oy, no. Okay. Yan, favorite, decent, mga decent favorite, uh, favorite, favorite natin yung mga ano, commentators. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> number five, Jim, Jim McMillan of the Lakers and that's a little what old the, yeah. I am not familiar with this guy. He man. also. I thought, <laughs> he, I thought he was box, really. I, I, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a Lakers guy. 
Yeah, he won. He won with the 72, 71, 72 Lakers. And that's the West team, huh? That's oh, the yeah. West and that's old way group. before yeah. our time. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, but from from what I read, that's in uh, that's in uh, what's his name, West, and who's that? Gail Goodrich. That's the retired Elgin Baylor. Right. Yeah, yeah. Elgin Hayes. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Yep. Elgin Baylor. That's what. That's Elgin Baylor. Yeah. Oh, ito yung nakad pampers palang si Jane yeah, nito. So, uh, 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 <laughs> number, Pardon my French. Uh, number number Good four. Day, <laughs> number four, Jalen Rose. Okay, he's he's pretty pretty good. Yeah. Number three is Hal Greer. He was pretty good. Oh, yeah. Don't like his don't like his post career shit. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you try Jefferson again? Yeah, yeah. Number number oh, three, Hal Greer. <laughs> Hal yeah, Greer. Sixers and yep. Oh, Hall of, Hall of Famer. And drum roll, Hall please. Of Famer, yeah. Number two. Jay's favorite, Carl Malone. But <laughs> <laughs> uh, yan ang yan ang bad luck thirteen. <laughs> <dude. laughs> but okay, he's a lucky thirteen at all. Number two, Carl Malone, and then Booker's yeah. there, and who's and who's number one? Of course, the great late. Kobe, Kobe Bryant. Bryant. <laughs> So you know what we're well, I guess what we're saying is it's 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 funny how you who was drafted at thirteen, the probably the best thirteenth uh-huh. draft ever in the history of the NBA is his idol, which right. is Kobe Bryant. Uh-huh. That's cool. That's 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 that's, that's pretty cool. That's uh, okay. So out of any, lower lower Marion High School. <laughs> um, Actually, God, dami, ano nga, like I was, I was, I was telling. Oh, I was telling you guys there's a lot of Thank you, parallels. bloody divas. <laughs> there, there are a lot of parallels between uh the how Kobe star I mean, the story of Kobe and, and Booker and how they even had yes, to fight and for Booker. Yeah, and had to, how, how they yeah, had to man. fight for minutes early on in their career and all that. And I, I know I was watching right. this uh, mini do, I, mini docu. There's a lot of para- yeah. parallelisms. Yeah. Booker was not highly touted. No, he was he was highly touted, but he he came out a little bit too early. Remember, he was so young. He was one so year young. in right. one year of Kentucky, ba siya? Kentucky yata. Eh. Wait, yeah, yeah, Kentucky. Say. And the problem was yeah. that was I a stock, so. that yeah. was a stock Kentucky squad. Who? Yes, it was a very stock Kentucky squad. Now he was he was he had to fight for minutes, and he had yeah. he went off the bench. That's why Mejo pagdating ng draft because he wasn't able to well he chose Kentucky and he wasn't able to really showcase his skills there. You know about there his value but yeah. coming out of high school he was I think the number one three point shooting prospect coming out, coming out of high yeah, school. Yeah yeah. And it's just it, it's just fine. Was he even part of the rookie team? I wonder in that year. I'm not oh, that's him. a good question. Uh, I'm pretty sure he was. I'm pretty sure. Was he? He yeah. Well, he are no, no. Rookie well, he team, had... huh? No, no. But uh, he was in his rookie year. I don't think so, because in his rookie year he was there. No, but he was. He no. was. He was back up for who was that? Ano? Uh, Eric Bledsoe. When Bledsoe was with the Suns, pa. And then when Bledsoe got injured, that's right. when Booker moved into the starting lineup. Wait. And then do nasha nag. Yeah. And then he never. But, the... No, but I'll confirm this now. He but was the Suns or... also. He's averaged he 13 right? points. Yeah. yeah, 13 points. Not all yeah. rookie naman siya. Ah, okay. At, yeah. at 13. I pulled it I out. I would think. Uh, but you're right. Even, you're even right. playing behind Bledsoe. Well, average. But that was the point there for the Suns. At, at, at a certain point, the Suns decided, we don't need right. Bledsoe. This, this kid's going to be better. Right. And they were right. But I I do remember that the 2000 because that was the year right after the Warriors won. I remember that he was a hot shooting rookie. Na com- because nga, like Mike was saying, Tama that that was a stacked Kentucky squad, and then no one you think thought that. But actually, they were even questioning why Booker came out so early because right. he could have had one year pa in Kentucky as the mm. star na, yeah, diba? And then he'll get a yeah. higher position. But yep. it, I guess it all worked out now also for him. Uh, actually. Based since we're talking about draft picks, we should go. But do you have any thoughts on the game? Let's let's maybe we should. How do you think this is series is gonna go? Yeah, going let's to go back to the game, Mike. Yeah, yeah. the series, seguro. Right. Ako, for me, uh, me, me. Uh, no, go ahead, uh, Sagaje. No, go, go, go. Okay, man. no, no. For me, I think the Bucks have to make this an ugly 
contest for them to have a chance. Series. It has to be a parang grit and grind type of game. Because if this is if it's freewheeling like this and you know it's trading baskets and all that, they can't hang with the Suns. They, they can't hang with the Suns' offense. So I have feeling they ha- I mean, with with what what series was that? But that they they did that. Because the, the, the Bucks can, can rough it up pretty well. Eh. With the Hawks. They have the size to rough with it up. Yeah, with the Hawks, right? Uh, yep. So I think they have to make it an ugly contest for them to to have a chance against the Suns. Me naman, if, if, it's, if it's that, if, if it's them trying to make it an uh, ugly ball and, and win by doing that, they still have to control the game first. Right. Parang of of the first two games we've seen, Chris Paul and the Suns have really taken care really well of that yeah. ball and and, Agree. and controlled the game from start to finish, man. So it might be hard to do, but it's it's a thought. It's a good thought. If they can control the game, control the pace, slow it down, and make it more of that that ugly, dirty kind of ball, then maybe not. Yeah. yeah, and then then I don't know. I don't know lang. I, I, Kasi I don't have... also if they have the roster to do that. Because eh. well, eh, the, the Suns bench, is, even with the injuries, eh, it's still yeah. deeper. Eh. And it's quicker. They're, they're, they're quicker yeah. the more. Ano? So, you know, problem is yeah. that Way eh. quicker. Yep. Right. There's a, we have a comment right. here. No? We have a couple of comments here, actually, from Migs, Migs De Leon. Uh, maybe we can start factoring... In coaching already. Look at the adjustments earlier when the Bucks were making a run. Can, can I can I make a comment, Muna, with this? Because because I completely agree. Um, All right, I'll make a, re- a re- I'll make a really quick comment that, for from what I've seen so far, Coach Bud adjusted enough to enter in this game because <laughs> and the Suns the Suns scores one eighteen in game one and one eight and the Bucks score one oh five in game one. Oh, Coach Bud adjusted and told them, "Oi, isa pang three pointer, bakamata, tayo." <laughs> <laughs> so it's funny. It's like the Suns. Yeah. You can say that. You know, I'm sure it's not that way, but you can say that the Suns played exactly the same ball game, <laughs> all the way yeah. to the same. Oh, I mean, Dimash. different different people lang scored yeah. different points, but they scored one eighteen, yeah. and it was a, uh, and and the box. Pretty much did not, did adjust, not adjust <laughs> enough. <laughs> there, were, there were how many points of adjustment? Uh, kulang. They needed they needed what thirteen points to adjust, and they only did three. Yeah. Or, ba? or oh no, ten points to adjust, and they, what's the final score of the second game? But the, one of five, end, eight points. They, they were they won by eight the first time. Eight one five. spread. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. 13, 13, 118, yeah, 105. Points. Yeah, yeah. It was five points. No? Uh, it was eight points. Second uh, game. Uh, yeah. So. <laughs> But it's the that's so there. No, but uh, it was it, it was also mentioned earlier. Uh, they they did a better job of defending the pick and roll. Yeah. Eton wasn't as productive today. Did not pull down yeah. as much rebounds. But collectively, the stun, the Suns were still able to do anything they wanted. No, but I'm just I, I'm on on that mix by on who commented yeah, yeah. right. Yep. Mi- mix yes, I, yes. I, yeah. Um, it's a complete lack of adjustment from Bud right now. Why I don't see why Giannis is right. not playing a five. You know, I, I don't see him experimenting with this oh, lineup enough. A little a little yeah. crazier, yeah. Sana, the idea. Yep. Remember the first half? The first Giannis half? made kalab- buhat kabayo, yeah. buhat kalabaw, whatever it is today, man. And he did everything he could. I don't know if you saw it. It looked like the first half for me was the Suns looking very relaxed, getting any shot they want and waiting for their waiting long for their time to make a run yep. while the Bucks looked very which, hit up, uh, which hit up. again yeah. Yeah. right which again happened in the third no? Mm-hmm. eventually in the third yeah. again they pulled parang away that, diba? yeah parang that third starter is theirs so far yeah so uh, yeah I, I definitely think Bud should be doing more Monty is parang Monty is doing the right thing he's waiting and seeing and he's adjusting now as to what he sees, On, but will adjust yeah. because but, but doesn't that right. crap yet really? To, to no way, and, and, and so I think the big difference between the two, and you see it only my in a small scale because because they're winning, na nga, so you don't yeah. see because he he doesn't really 
Monty doesn't really have the need to, to make major adjustments. That's on Bud. But you see Monty doing adjustments on the fly, right? Oh, you yeah, see yeah. it there, little things, man. Match, match, uh, mismatch here, mismatch there. Right. Pick and roll here or whatever it is. And he's allowing Chris Paul to, to call it based on what he's seeing on the right, court. Right. There's nothing like that from Coach Bud. Eh? Parang yeah. He waits for the game to be over before he starts you know, thinking right. about what else to do. I, is, it, Major maybe, difference. Yeah, maybe it's also Monty's faith in Chris Paul because, like, the one you were saying, those Booker threes late in the game. Did you see it? Um, between yeah, Tucker, right? between Tucker, between Tucker and Giannis on that defensive. Now, why was si Tucker? Biglang libre si Booker. Right, right. Like, how's that supposed to happen? Right. 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 Chris Paul Booker, right. hindi yun dapat malilang. Hindi kasi siya sanay eh. Sanay si Tucker guarding the bigger guys down low. Right. Pag nandun siya sa taas, nawawala yeah. siya pag nakasclean. Yeah, that's a good point, Jay. Yeah. Oh, parang dapat all NBA defensive player naman si ano? Yeah, pero Drew, I think they should utilize him guarding Booker more. Well, baka ngayon, baka in Julia sa point after all na he lost a step or two already. <laughs> <laughs> Hindi <laughs> <laughs> lang katamaran, talagang ano. I just, you know, you know okay, I'll just say it kasi is that we all know how, I mean, I'm not going to pull out the numbers, but they gave up a lot for Drew. I mean, right. and yes, they made they the did. finals. They, they made the finals now. So technically, it's an achievement. But we were talking, it's an achievement year yeah. for the Bucs. They're in the finals. Still a step but, up, yes. But if Booker, if this is Booker's, if Booker is on his peak on the way sliding down, they better start hurrying up also because they gave up so much of picks and future that book Jeru's right. not gonna be New Orleans Jeru for the next three, four years right, as the box right. is contending. Right. You know what I mean? He will oh. start going down. Yeah. Philadelphia will get yeah. stronger, Atlanta. Right. So they have to they have these the next Celtics are still there. The Cel- mm-hmm. of, yeah, yeah. Celtics. So they gave up a lot for Jeru for him to feel like he's even losing some step. You know, he should be like, for what they gave up for for him on the trade, he should be assessing his his game right. or his mark mm-hmm. on this game by either, yeah, whether it's defensively on Booker or being his shifty scorer or whatever. And we don't see it, at least in the last... He did it in game five and six in Atlanta when wala si He did. He did. Not not so yeah. far in this series. 27, 28 points, yeah. no? Right. So uh, parang ano, parang the guards of the the guards of the Suns are really, you know, way better and are able to defend him also. You you have Aton pa as an as a last, yeah. you know, as a last defender. Pag nakalusot, hirap eh. The shots change or you know. All right. Ganda, ganda ng hands ni Aiton. Not, not, n- not aesthetically yet, but he has good hands, man. <laughs> wow, ganda ng fingers ni Aiton. No, the guy has a soft yeah. touch and he... Wild, no? Even if, even if the pass is major, really tight na, ha, right. he's yeah. able to still get it and then roll it in, man. It doesn't have to be a dunk for him all the time. It is that he's, good. Yeah, it's very soft around the rim. I mean, it's... And he's not... Yeah, galing. In a good way. You know, in a good way. Yeah, in a good way. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's yeah. soft around soft. the ring in a good way. <laughs> and he's calmado? Hindi. Is that safe to say? Hindi not, siya yung... not in a Porzingis soft kind of way. <laughs> oh, here. <laughs> M- Miguel commented here. Yeah, you know, he is calmado. He is calmado. So, so Miguel commented here, thoughts on Brooke playing 28 minutes and their drop P- and their drop PNR coverage. Say Miguel or your Miguel? My Miguel. <laughs> my Miguel. Well, uh, we, anyone? I, I have. Yeah, I have an ahead. answer. But go guys, ahead. I think go twenty-eight ahead. minutes is a couple of minutes too much for Brooke. <laughs> I I think Giannis. On the I, PNR. Well, no, I, I don't know the PNR. Yeah, I just think that Brooke Lopez is their nice regular season center, steady. They'll get them wins, all that. Come this playoff time. Uh, I really think I had a batchmate who mentioned it. I'm um, shout out to Errol if he's watching. Errol mentioned it. Maybe it's about time to put Giannis at five to close the game or in crucial yeah, portions, which yeah, will dude. bring down Brook Lopez's playing time. So if what I see from Brook Lopez is that um, he he should more. If I'm gonna put it lang like the dubs, he should more. He should have like that Bogut role na lang. 
I mean, you know what I mean? You should start it. Start the second half. But when it's the closing of the f- closing of the first well, half, nah. close, dapat it should be your tight close closing unit or in a fast right. mm-hmm. with maybe Yanis right. and so here's three. my question here's my question to 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 that comment uh, or to the that uh who do you replace Brook Lopez with in that five do you replace him with a wing no you you're not Yanis him? you're using no, Yanis no 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 I mean five. I mean who do you put him put in instead of him Portis it becomes, do you put no, do you put in a but, but the Portis but technically I'd go Yanis Portis PJ Tucker PJ Tucker yes, yes. Um, middle Conaton, Middleton, Drew. That will be my five to yeah, close. That's it. That's the finishing five. If not Conaton, maybe Forbes if he's not hit so bad defensively. But around there now. So in other words, you have shooters around Giannis. All of them can shoot and right, are a right, little bit right, more right. mobile than a little bit more mobile than Bro. But that's yeah. that's how I would do it at least. Because uh, like you said, Jay, right. but no, Tucker, can, uh, Tucker can can guard uh, the bigs, bigs or, or yeah. the big people yeah. there. Yeah, but that's but, actually his forte. I mean, you put him in front trying to guard guards, and he he loses it. Booker had a wide open three, man. Here's, he he he's not used to being in front. He's not used to being in front and defending from there. Are you so we mentioned this earlier on that article on that article that we put out about about the box. Now, it I I really see Yanis as the center. Doing this Bill Russell role because he has enough scorers na mansana if they get open and they make the shots. <laughs> but that's that's exactly how I I see them being run. Diba? Yeah. He anchors the he anchors the D, gets them off and running, and then they score they score on the break. But voila, once they're caught and and he's the one bringing the ball down from half court, yeah. and it's a half court game already, and the game has slowed down offensively for them. Wala na. Yeah. Tapos yun what, were saying, what were you saying though, Mike? Also? No, no. We have another comment here. We have quite a few engagements today. Oh. Eh? So here, here's those another those comment nice. from nice. Enzo. Uh, Bobby Portis only played a total of 19 minutes so far. Should he have played more than Brook? Yes. Uh, me, yes. Yes. I mean, yeah. Oh. Yeah. yeah, I agree also. I'm with that. Port- Portis can be like their Jay Crowder. You just have you have to get it yes. going, right? Bad boy, bad boy. 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 Let me, let me, let me go, re, ano, also another comment here from our good friend John D. Okay. Right. CP. He should be on, he should be on the screen. Yeah, yeah, he should be. Nga. But anyway, oh, this is his contribution today. Uh, CP, <laughs> CP was good earlier. Oh, there were a lot of teams that will regret passing on CP this year. More power to Cameron Payne. <laughs> Astos! <laughs> Wait, what was it? Wait, um, Portis played how many minutes? How, how many how many minutes did Portis play? Well, did according it? to Enzo, he played nineteen minutes so far. I think, I think, I think, and nine... that's I think game one and two, huh? Yeah, yeah, that's I think I think what he oh, means wow. is uh total combined. Yeah, because combined. Actually, I, based on what I saw sa, sa second game now, now I think five minutes lang shad. That's really low. He should play more. He should play, yes. So that's a resounding, yeah. at least for me, that's a resounding right. yes. Yeah. Right, si Rafi. Si Rafi, may, Rafi may follow-up comment. I yeah. guess Crowder caught my comment last time. He got <laughs> lucky today. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's true. I mean, we, oh, even, oh, no, no, yeah. we were talking about, yeah. no, he yeah. mentioned yeah, but the he's shooting tre- of Crowder. He's streaky. Crowder is streaky. Right. So we can't, he can do well now. Is, I mean, well, based on the, then the next game, yeah. Yeah, based on the conference p- finals, my quota is one game that he shoots well. Eh? So yeah, yeah. this could be the game. <laughs> right. But okay, I wouldn't call this okay. He was plus ten. He had this is this is this is a technique. This is technically your crowder game. He had eleven points today. Uh-huh. Wait, today, but uh-huh. well, hold on. Booker had 31, Paul 23, Bridges 27. Okay, Crowder had 11 points, 10 rebounds, plus 10, and 3 for 5 from 3-pointers. 
That's a Crowder Even game. Even if he right. doesn't make his shots, eh. mm-hmm. that's the Crowder yeah. game. That's the Crowder mm-hmm. game. That you he contributes in a lot of um, other ways. Eh. Maybe the the ten rebounds was a wow. That's a double double. So maybe even uh, he had eleven in game one. He had eleven yeah. in game one. But they were like a Crowder uh, rebounds. Huh? You're happy now with Crowder if he does not even eleven eight, eleven six. That's right. that. But he defends yeah, well and yeah. it's a it's a few yes. good shots. So yes. Um, and even those shots he makes, some a lot of them are timely hits. Yung pang pang ano pang stop ng ng run ng box ganon type right. ng shots. Uh, or that, or that, or that Ali who passed from from yeah. from out of bounds to Aton, man. That was him. Also. Yeah. He has these little yeah. things that he yeah, does, right. man. That winning pace. The, the one in the Clippers game, no? That that right. That, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that, that was, was him. And that, that's yeah. why I like Crowder because he's more than the. But he's, he's he's that disruptor. Eh? He's he's your Pat Bev. He's your adult. But he's more than that. Eh? He's, he's more than just that disruptor. He has more, so many other things. More than that, that bully. Well, yeah. Yeah, naman ginawa si Pat Bev, eh? <laughs> well, as as of right now, he has the most finals experience among this right. among both That's teams. Right. Yep. He's the only one. He's the only yeah. one in this series that has finals experience. Know, actually, there are, there are a couple of ano, with Miami. Uh, th- Actually, I checked. There are a couple Lana. of mga bench guys, pero well, they haven't really played. So if you're talking about a player who has significant minutes in the finals, yeah, that's the only Crowder. Yeah, it's only Crowder. Oh, well, I'll just shout out to my friend Ted from Dubsland SFO for pointing that out before in our group. He was one of he was commenting in our right, oh, right, right. Right. yeah in our yeah, page, right. 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 So, uh, <laughs> Any more comments? Because I'll jump into something that Jay said about Aton. I, I, I have this thing that unless Aton see si, si Mix actually has a follow up comment after our, uh, after we reacted to his first one. Uh, Ganda ng Yanis at five, then move Portis to four. You can stretch the floor more and stretch Adirin. easily. Adirin. Ganda makita yes. Aton versus Yanis. What has to make this happen? So yeah, we agree. Yeah. That's <laughs> yeah. It, man. Let's see if Bud has it in him. <laughs> Thanks for that comment. Yep. Yeah, it, I, I, so I'll, kung wala, I'll, I'll, let's let's go into yeah. Aton. Diba? Nice his hands. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> nice his hands. <laughs> no, we will say okay. <laughs> Food for thought about Aton during the draft when he was drafted. Aton was drafted number one pick. Right. First pick in the uh-huh. Aton. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. But everything we've been hearing, I don't past, know where you're going. Uh, everything we've been hearing the past three years has been Luca, 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 <laughs> yeah. and everything has been Luca, Luca, Luca. And Trey Young has gotten to the Eastern Conference Finals. He got Trey four, and Aiton, who everyone said shouldn't have been the first pick, it should have been Luca, is now in the finals. So what do you guys? Yeah. I'm not. I probably <laughs> still draft Luca one, but isn't this yeah. so interesting Uh-oh. that? I'll interject, huh? Okay, there, okay, there are ahead. two ways, eh, diba? Yeah. A team will will either pick the best person or the best player for what the team needs or what is necessary to make the team competitive and, and running for a championship. On the other hand, you choose the best player, whatever position that player is. And what the Suns did there was got the guy they needed. Yeah, it's working up at time. A center, right. no? They needed a center. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Because they already had book. Yeah. All right. Ikaw, Mike. What and they, they had they yeah, had some I of mean, the other roster players. There are I mean, depending on where you're coming from, there are arguments for 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 Luca or Aton or even Trey. But for me, because it you can't really say that it was a mistake or, you know, Aton has proven that he should be the number one pick again because it depends on the team who's drafting yeah, at okay. number one. Eh. So, if you look at, and it's more than the decision of who to pick in the draft, it's also the decision that the team, actually, more importantly, the decisions the team have to has to make after the draft and how he's he's going to utilize that pick or surround, surround that, you know, pick with players that can, you know, Play well together for that for the championship. So, right. so yeah, it's interesting, lang na you know how these picks big lang you know like again going back to our conversation earlier, a Donovan Mitchell comes out of 13th pick, de to be yeah. to be the franchise player, pala. And if you're looking at um, Booker, book. I mean, just look at Booker and 
Donovan Mitchell, they right? the from that thirteen pick, they they they're turning out to be the franchise, the the cornerstone of their you know respective franchises. Yeah. So so yeah. Yeah. Well, I'll add to that. Yeah, but I I pretty much agree. It's that I think this is because people um there are those two schools now that you draft by you draft by fit or you draft the best right. player yeah. possible, but. Right. Normally, well, at least in the, the podcast and the media, you'll always hear the fact that you always get the best player. I mean, like it's like a 60-40 deal. Right. You just get if, if you're a lowly team, there's no fit. You just get the best player right. available. You yeah. just get the best. Right. But in this case, you know what? Aiton may never be the best, might not be, probably in the history of the NBA, the best player in this draft. It might be Luca. I mean, I'm, I mean, safe to say right. it might right. be Luca. It, it might be Trey. Okay. Um, yeah. but definitely for the Phoenix Suns at this time, this was a correct pick. There's no question about it. It's paying that. dividends on the idea. Uh, yeah. 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 I mean, what would they have done with Luca and Booker? I don't think they would have meshed. I don't know yet. I, I, I can't say. They could have clashed. There could have been this whole Booker once out. You know, there, there could have been a personality ego thing. Wherein as Aiton yeah. came in, Aiton knew his role. He was the big guy. Right. It didn't clash, right. it didn't clash with Booker. It didn't clash right. with eventually Chris Paul. Can you imagine it? How could they right. have brought Chris Paul in right. if you had Luca? <laughs> right. Well, and, nah, and no actually, space. either way, either and, way you go, yeah. either way you go, whether you go for fit or the best player, you know, it can go either way also of being a bust and then the success. Yeah. Yeah. Ngayon, if you're talking about, you know, the Suns picking the right player, the player that they needed at that time, you can go back to the 80, uh, the 84 draft and Portland picking Sam Bowie over Jordan. Which went the other way, naman. Which yeah. went the other way, naman, <laughs> diba? I mean, if you look yeah, at it, yeah, 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 yeah. you know, Blazers had yeah, Drexler yeah. already. The Blazers needed a center. That's, yeah. They passed on MJ. So, and yeah. then... Yeah. That was the other side of the coin for the yeah. Aton thing. Yep. Because they had Clyde Drexler now. Yep. But here, and the they Sun, picked what they needed for they the needed. team. And that went yeah. bad. And that went... That yes. Went, that became infamous. Okay. Yeah. It's, it's, it's <laughs> ano lang, ah, timing lang yung comment ko. Ka- I mean, that's anyway. Michael Jordan you passed up on. Man. <laughs> yeah. No, it's a ti- it's a go. timing the comment kasi Bobby Alvarez just commented here, always oh, get the oh. best player. Kalokohan yeah, yeah. yung drafting for fit or even worse, uh-huh. drafting by position. Eddie Sana, the Blazers never drafted Sam Bowie. <laughs> yeah. Yo, yeah. Oh, yeah. Good yeah. point, Bobby. Yeah. Uh, hui, Bobby. How are you? Long time. Yep. Um, but it's right there. Mr. Bluesman. I know. Uh, Mexicali Bluesman. That was great. Um, yeah. You always, you always draft me at that. But I think now, what, what, more where I'm coming from is the Suns don't have to hear that chatter for them, at least at this oh. point. Now, wow, why did you get Luca? Why no. did you get Luca? Right, right. <laughs> We're in the final. I even bother listening. It's all yeah. working yeah. out. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I I have a third year center who averaged 14 points, 10 rebounds in the regular season. Okay, Luca's gonna be great, but we got our championship right. ahead right. of time. Right. We wanted. So right. we're good right. then. Kumbaga. Yeah, yeah it would have been nice to get yeah. Luca, but yeah. we're okay. Kumbaga. Now, Sacramento na lang, why didn't you draft him? <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yeah, like your question. Yeah. Why, well, why, they have a history in a money of bad drafting, man. <laughs> That's can the kings we're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> and on that note also yeah. is that can you imagine that I'm glad. I'm glad it's not gonna be a chip on Trey Young's shoulder that he was traded for Luca. Because we all know Luca's gonna be great. I mean, all the signs are there enough yeah. for great. Um right. he even right. led, right. you know, like, he led Slovenia to their very first Olympics. Can you imagine? They beat they beat Lithuania, they beat Sina uh, Valenciuna, which is a powerhouse, which yeah. is a powerhouse, yeah. Yeah. first ever. And then, uh, who's that really annoying? Not that annoying. Sorry, he, he might see this. Who's that? <laughs> <laughs> that 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 international Colin Cowherd. All right, yeah, 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 okay. Yeah, yeah. He's not annoying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like you. It's just like, <laughs> You, you come out you come out very strong maybe like me uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> he had a nice piece on about how great but he does so small was and he goes that and he went on about luca bringing slovenia to the olympics 
and Slovenia only has like a population of 2 million people. <laughs> uh. <laughs> and you have all these other stars with like 40 yeah. million, 100 million. Yeah. So he was saying like, Luca, per, per 100,000 population is the best. <laughs> something like that it was just uh, funny so uh, so he brings such so your level of talent in million people right, right. as compared to looking for the levels of talent in like a yeah, hundred million yeah. population he took this small group of slovenians <laughs> all the way to the olympics yeah. wild i mean so that's we all know Lucas yeah, gonna be good. yeah so it's good naman that trey who was also he was hit in his rookie year but he was so bad and all that i don't i think it's safe to say that chip that it wasn't a good trade. I think it's a little bit off naman. Yeah, I think I think older. Yeah, I think Bumawi na si trade doon. No? Because early on it looked like a lopsided trade, diba? Pero if you look yeah. at if you look at this year and and I mean last year pa lang and then this year. But you're seeing na, na okay, maybe it's not. And diba we were talking about it in our chat room nga na how you know this tray, this whole tray Luca rivalry that's brewing parang it, it's it's beginning to look like uh, LeBron uh, versus Steph all over again yeah <laughs> yep European LeBron so, versus, huh? yeah <laughs> European you LeBron can, you can compare the games <laughs> yep the kind of game they yeah, are very similar yeah. right? so. very similar yep okay well, how, how's how, how's our prediction board Mike <laughs> okay <laughs> Our prediction board. Let me pull it up. Nusundan pa ba yan? Puro voodoo naman ako dyan eh. Eh, wala final So, wala. After the game, wala. I'm on tagilid na ako dito. Dude, uh, you're still up by one. So, it's 45-23 against 44-24 for me. He's gonna but keep then, picking yeah, the Suns, man. Exactly. <laughs> so, at oh, some no, point, no. at some point, I will have to gamble and uh, pick the Bucks. No, well, let's explain. Let's explain it. We we were doing this prediction game a couple of days into the playoffs. We just decided to pick teams right. from every single game, yeah, yeah. Uh, right. Playoff, yeah. game. Right. And this and and this is the win loss. So, kumbaga, if I well, my win there is whatever game I got correct, and my loss whatever mistake I had. Right. So yeah, so you've been trying to catch just up. Just to explain, so that I don't. I so gonna... that I don't look like a moron on that standing yeah, so... thing. I started yeah, yeah. picking the team I actually wanted to lose. Just yes. so we're clear. Yeah, so, so, so Jay, that's all voodoo, man. So Jay, can you explain why you did that? <laughs> oh. That's a whole, oh, that's that's a whole, a whole episode. episode. Sige, sige. Let's, Let's get save into that. that voodoo thing eventually. Yeah, we yeah. should talk about that right but, before. So, ano, so, fantasy season. Yeah, uh, the, before the fantasy yeah, season. Should, Perfect. Yeah. That fantasy episode we should, that we, we do. Should. Oh, maybe we should, ano, ah, maybe we should do, we should live stream our fantasy draft. Of course, we're gonna live stream our fantasy draft. That's, 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 that's not even. No, yeah, right? that's, gonna, that's gonna be so trippy, man. Yeah, they're gonna see how bad we are at drafting. <laughs> uh, at least we can. And yeah, so, maganda, we can record it. Para we can go back to the to it to the draft after the season ends. Yeah. And and babalikan right. natin yung mga when people laughed at you for picking certain players and then they turn out. <laughs> Hey, hey, I, uh, let, just uh, let me explain my who got there. Ah, because I have who got there. Let me just get it off why? my chest. Because I remember, mga a few years ago, I drafted uh, Yanis and uh, I, I drafted Yanis yeah. and Kat as my first okay, and yeah. second pick. I was, I was, we were like ten in the league at anon. So Yanis and Kat were my tenth and eleventh pick, and you guys laughed at me. And that was the year that, that was the year that Yanis became a triple double machine and Kat became a triple double machine. And I almost won but I think injuries lang eh pero yeah. pero, no, yeah. But you guys was that the was that the year I won? <laughs> yeah. You won your rookie year like magic by the <laughs> No, he did. No. Sige na. Let me no, what si net up no, no, eh. No, Sige na. <laughs> Uh, not win his rookie wow. so for more year thanks for the birthday greeting yeah, yeah of course yeah. dude of course <laughs> oh, for more so for more I gotcha oh, man I, I gotcha I got third lang my uh, first year I, I, just know that, I, I just know that Jay will draft Sabonis again next year uh, yeah that's for sure Ako, and, man, uh, Miles Turner Sabonis Miles Turner, combo yeah. dude for the so win you, you were strong this year Kevin Werther <laughs> Wala you naman know, nangyari. I ended up second place. And then, wala rin. I'm, I'm picking the box. 
for next game, Mike. So okay. on our prediction, oh. I'm, <coughs> you I'm are. going back. You are. Oh, yep. okay. well, ako, I, I have to make a move, so I'm going Suns. Jay. I have the Suns. You have the Suns. I'm just box bukas. Uh, yeah, on, I, on unless Monday. I see something really big from, from Coach Bud, uh, we might be seeing more of what we've already been seeing. Not to take anything away from the finals. Huh? And I hope the Bucks get the win because I, I want this to, to stretch out a little longer. And we'll see, you know. I hope I hope that Bud makes the right uh, the right calls on, on how to go about trying to get the win. Well, ako, one thing one thing that will be critical in that game three, no, is uh during Yanis's free throws, wala na magbibilang pare. So maybe he'll make more. <laughs> hey, you know what? I, I I was texting my my <laughs> I was texting my batch group. Now they should actually get together and start counting one, three, six, yeah, seven, just four. to mess you up, the <laughs> Because I notice he shoots better at the 12 second yeah. mark, di ba? Pag yeah, I was going to say, I was gonna say yeah. he's making it a rhythm. In he's his using head. it yeah. now as a. Yeah. And you yes, know what's funny? Rhythm, yeah. You know what's funny, Kanina? He, there, was a, there, was a, there was a free throw that was so off because he shot it at the 10, 10 second mark. Parang pati siya nagulat na yeah. his dribble. He was picking right. up, he was already. Yan ba he was. No, it, it hit the front of the rim, if, I, if I'm not mistaken. Pero I saw his face. And it's eight second mark, palang na kaganyan na siya. Yeah. And I'm like, oh my god, masyado at ang maaga pa. Masyado at ang maaga. Kulang ng dalawa yung dribble. Uh, uh, kulang ng dribble. Uh, but he, he shot 60% today, yeah. ha? a little over. Well, that's his average. <laughs> that should be funny. They give all the. They give all the fans the That's numbers. A little higher than the number. In their yeah. seats, they pull out on a one, seven, eight, two, four. <laughs> and Jan is like, Anak ng Jan, malili two si Jan. <laughs> okay, next game is on Monday. So, like, Monday. Our, our next episode will be on Monday. So, for everyone watching, right. uh, for this finals at least, we'll be, uh, we'll be live streaming after the game at around 1 p.m. Um, local time, Philippines time. So you can expect us to be, and we'll give an announcement on the day of right. the game. Yeah, what should, time? Should, yeah, should there be any changes? Yeah. Like today, because we had to do it at two because of uh, uh, the birthday boys' uh, lunch yeah, extravaganza. Boy. <laughs> Dealing with a hangover and uh, <laughs> having my birthday oh, lunch with the family. You know what? I'm gonna so, make this sing it. Wait, I'll make this sing it long before. You have any final thoughts? I wanna make one last thought. Sing it about. Go ahead. Uh, go ahead. Um, since we didn't get to, I, I'm not sure if we wanted to get Kase into this really, really in depthly also. But since Mike made a countdown of the the top ten best thirteen picks so far in the NBA, why don't we just make a? Why don't I just show you who was drafted right before Devin Booker, <laughs> just to give you an idea? <laughs> so if Devin say Booker, yeah, yeah, I'll say it straight. So if Devin Booker was drafted thirteenth, and this is to show you how NBA teams can just miss yeah. the mark. Number one was Cat. <laughs> okay lang. Number okay, two was yeah. Dilo. Number three, Jal Jalil hey. Okafor. Number four, Kristaps uh -huh. Okay. Number five, Mario <laughs> Hezodia. Okay, wala na. Number <laughs> six, Willie Collins Stein, the better Kentucky player now. <laughs> Denver, <laughs> Emmanuel Moudier for Denver. Remember him? Yes. Stanley Johnson, yeah. Detroit. There's Can you imagine? Yeah. <laughs> Frank Frank Kaminsky, uh, who's with Phoenix now. The yeah. second, the second backup center yeah. for Phoenix. <laughs> Number ten, Justice Winslow over Booker. Can you imagine? <laughs> Miles Miles Turner, okay lang, he's good. Trey okay, Lyles, Trey, Trey Lyles, can talk it in pala siya. So and then and then we get Devin Booker, and then guess who came after Devin Booker pa? Cameron Payne, teammate Cameron. niya. Yep. At fourteen, and to finish it off at fifteen. Poppy, Poppy Dubs, <laughs> Kelly Oubre, <laughs> Tsunami Poppy, si Kelly Walang Oubre, yeah, <laughs> who will leave us? <laughs> Wale next season. Yeah, <laughs> sige. So, yeah, na. Uh, okay, wala. wrap it up. All right. That was the huddle, guys. Uh, we said it first here on the bench. The bench. <laughs> okay, see you. Okay, yeah. See you guys next. See you guys. See you guys bye bye. Thanks for All watching. All right, man. Cheers. Bye bye.